we tell him which are the areas of his personality which is lacking this kind of feedback which SSVs cannot give. We give this kind of feedback. How he can develop his personality, what actions he has to take. Ultimately, guys, success or failure in life is just a game of your personality. Every one of us gives you marks out of how much to qualify. Yes, but generally, I will tell you where you stand. Be participating in the group discussion. Sometimes you start off and then you stop for some time. Yes. And uh, that kind of periodic participation should be there. Okay. And it will, uh, with a little more effort, you will be very close. In yes. fact, you should be able to make it. Yes. You can now get a free SSB course under the guidance of Major General Bhakani at SSB Short Short Academy if you attend any of our written courses for NDS, CDS or FCAT. Attend 4-5 to five lectures daily and prepare with study material, mentor support, weekly feedback, mock tests and guidance by officers in our lush green 28-acre military campus. Call us now on 725-930-7111 for queries and registrations. Now let's get back to the video. We tell him which are the areas of his personality which is lacking this kind of feedback which SSVs cannot give. We give this kind of feedback. How he can develop his personality, what actions he has to take. Ultimately, guys, success or failure in life is just a game of your personality. If you have a dynamic personality, if you are a positive man, if you are a confident person, if you are really energetic, enthusiastic and a dynamic guy, success in life is sure. So this is what we are going to tell the candidate, to which are the areas where he has to focus and which are his stronger areas. Okay, And we also answer his questions that how he can face the services selection board in a very original and natural style without putting on any kind of behavior because we believe in honesty, truthfulness and originality. This is what we want to inculcate in our candidates. So we are going to start. Shall we call the first candidate? Yes, sir. Okay. Welcome. Good morning, Pratiksha. How are you? Good morning, sir. Sir, I'm fine. Please sit down. So, Pratiksha, you are from which place? Sir, I'm from Satara. Well, tell me two reasons why you want to join the armed forces. Sir, my parents, my father was in the Indian Army. That's, he motivated me firstly. And I always wanted life to be extraordinary. I don't, I wanted to be adventurous. And I want a life where I can serve my country. At the same time, I can enjoy my life. And that's what I feel that armed forces is the place where I can actually be, uh, where I can actually put, give my 110% and serve my nation. Okay, tell me two reasons why you should be selected. So I think uh, the outgoing nature of mine, uh, which is required in armed forces. So uh, I get easily adjustable to the places. I get easily adjustable to all the people. And also uh, I am courageous and also adventurous. So these two reasons uh, make uh, makes me, I think that uh, are responsible that you should actually select me. Okay. Tell me why do you think you are courageous and adventurous? So because I have been part of many sporting activities uh, and uh, in sporting activities I have always been uh, the one of the uh, enthusiastic person who always try to win the match. Tell and me Pratiksha, simple question. Tell me two things you learned in this academy. Sir, number one is uh, be patient. Uh, you need to perceive each and every situation first and act accordingly. Okay. Anything else? Yes, sir. And also be confident. Believe in yourself. Okay. Good, Pratiksha. You have done reasonably well. Let me see what the psychologist has to say to you. That uh, she is very good. And she is only a little impulsive and it also makes her thoughts unorganized. So if she becomes patient and if she is a little more organized, then she can do very well. 
Okay, let me see what the G2 has to say. Pratiksha is a very lively person, physically extremely fit and qualified in various fields and has taken very active part in all the group activities. What she has to work on now is a little more clarity in the power of expression. Uh, one should be able to spoo- uh, speak more smoothly because it will help you in your uh, the PPD generation and other um, uh, the things including the lecture. So you can improve a little bit on that also, otherwise you are doing well. And if you say, uh, if I have to give you the marks, then somewhere about uh, 88 to 90 is what I would write. Okay, Pratiksha, overall, let me tell you this. As you know that, though every one of us gives you marks out of how much? 225. Yes, sir. But generally, I will tell you where you stand. You are almost, you are making the grade. I very strongly feel that this is the first time you are going. Yes, sir. And Pratiksha, you are going to get through. Once I tell a candidate he will get through, God's grace, it has always been the case. The candidate has made it. So I you, am giving you as an interviewing officer 92 out of 225, which shows that you are making the grade. And you are going to give us a good news. Will you give us? Yes, sir. Surely. Good. God bless you. Anything you want to ask? Sir, no, sir. Thank you. God bless you and all the best. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you. you, ma'am. Thank you, sir. Excuse me, sir. May I come in? Please come in, Guranjali. Sir. Good. Please sit down. Yes, sir. So, Guranjali, do you think you are absolutely ready to face the SSB? When is your SSB? Sir. For ma'am. which entry? And where is it? Sir, I think I'm 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 ready for my interview, sir. So SSB interview. And it is scheduled on 26 February at Bhopal, sir. You didn't tell me which entry? Sir, it is SSC Tech uh, Navy, sir. Okay, SSC Tech Navy. Yes, sir. Tell me, now if I simply say, how will you describe yourself in three sentences? I describe myself as a confident person, sir. I am very punctual too. I, I will take responsible of everything and I am practical, sir. Okay. So, why do you consider yourself practical? Sir, I think that I won't be uh, engaged in uh, certain thing which is of imaginary. I just uh, prepare my thoughts into action, sir. I just be putting efforts to make my act- thoughts into action, sir. Hence, I think myself as a practical. Okay. Tell me two things which you find the best here in this academy, which really made you learn something. Yes, sir. I think that it is an acting school because uh, uh, the... Uh, it is not theory basically. It was full of uh, uh, ground task and we can be engaged uh, in every part. That is, we didn't waste even a single say, minute or something, sir. We 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 were also we were also thinking and our thoughts and our thoughts were organized uh, just for an interview and we were being uh, always imagining ourselves as an officer, sir. Okay, let me see what the psychologist has to yes, say. Sir. So I feel that you are a good from heart person, yes. but I also think that you take unnecessary stress and I think you will get anxious at times, so you mm-hmm. should work on those things. Okay. Yeah, let's see what the G2 has to say. Gunanjali, you are reasonably lively yes. and you are physically fit also. Yes, you have also been actively <coughs> taking part in the all the activities yes, sir. and uh, uh, what you need to do is to uh, uh, the uh, reg- uh, the continuously be participating in the group discussion. Sometimes you start off and then you stop for some time. Yes. And uh, that kind of periodic participation should be there. Okay. And it will, uh, with a little more effort, you will be very close. In yes. fact, you should be able to make it. Yes. Okay, so Goranjali, my last word for you is, yes. you got to be a little more bold. Yes. And a little more assertive. And let me tell you, the major thing which I have noted down about you is you tend to come under pressure. I don't know why. Okay? Yes, sir. And let me tell you, if you become little more confident, little more bold, yes, little more assertive, you are likely to make the grade. Yes, sir. But as of now, you are a borderliner. 
Okay, yes. I will grade you somewhere around 87 marks out of 225. Yes. You are just about three to four marks behind. Yes. So you have to give this finishing touches in your personality. Okay. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Okay, any suggestion for us to improve? Sir, I think there is. Okay, no God bless you all the best. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye bye. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Good evening. Prapti, how are you? I'm doing good, sir. Okay, Prapti, please sit down. Yes, sir. Prapti, tell me. Yes, sir. You have been working in the corporate. Yes, sir. In a good leadership role. Do you really consider you are a leader? Absolutely, sir. I do really consider that myself. Give, give me three reasons why you consider yourself a leader. So I believe that I have the ability to influence a group and I've been doing that from my school days itself. I've been a class monitor, a placement coordinator, the discipline captain of my school. So I know how to work with the team. I'm also very confident and I'm also very good at communication. So I know that the messages that are going through me are going to be the most accurate and precise. Okay, tell me, Prapti, simple question. Yes, sir. Why didn't you make the grade in your last two attempts? This is your third attempt. Yes, I did. Why attempt. you didn't make it the grade in the last two attempts? So in the first attempt, uh, I wasn't very participative in my PGT, FGT, HDT as well. Also in my GD and GPE, uh, I didn't participate well because uh, because of the fish market that was created. And I don't believe that if my words don't put any worth to the discussion, if they are just going to evaporate in the air, I don't, I tend not to speak usually. Secondly, sir, I believe uh, that in my interview, I was uh, not very sure of my answers, but now I'm definitely, I'm very sure of my answers and I will make sure that the this surety in my answers is seen in the interview as well. And thirdly, I would say, sir, I was not well prepared with the uh, psychology. But now again, I... Okay, I tell me a simple question. Yes, sir. You correctly identified your shortcomings. Yes, sir. Tell me, in the last 12 days, how do you think you have overcome these three shortcomings? So in the GTO, since we had uh, about five to six outdoor GTO classes, uh, I, I have practiced enough number of PGTs, FGTs, command tasks. So I'm very confident with all of those. I learned, uh, I learned a couple of knots as well, which are very important and I'm able to work around those knots. Uh, secondly, sir, uh, we had four psychology tests and I, I can visibly see the improvement uh, that I've made in all the progressively in all the four psychology tests. Uh, and thirdly, sir, definitely the interview feedback that I got. I'm constantly working on them and definitely I'll make it. OK, Thanks. let me tell you, Prapti, you are almost there. Yes, sir. Look at this as an interviewing officer. I have graded you. Oh my God, you are pass 91 out of 225. Yes, sir. I declare you as a pass. This time, once I tell a candidate he's going to pass, yes, let sir. me tell you, this has come 99.9% .9 true. Yes, sir. You are going to give us good news. Yes, sir. Sure, sir. That Prapti has made it. I am putting you in the category of a successful candidate. Is that understood? Yes, sir. Okay. So be just be confident. And only thing I have written, you need to be a little more decisive. Yes, sir. A little more dynamic. Yes, sir. And of course, an active participation in all the facets of the SSP. Yes, sir. Particularly yes, sir. the GTO 9 task. Yes, sir. Be active participants. Yes, sir. Okay? Yes, sir. And you are surely going to make it. Let me see what the GTO has to say yes, about you. Prapti, you've been a very lively person, physically also very fit, have been an achiever and also doing a very good job. And you are focused now towards getting into the armed forces. You have participated very well in all the activities. Yes, sir. And I wouldn't be surprised if you stitch a pair of uniform very soon. Yes, sir. I will, sir. Yeah, let's see the psychologist. So I think that uh, you are a quick learner and uh, when we were doing the corrections, so you learned it nicely, but I still think that you tend to overanalyze certain yes, things. This is why while you're executing it, you're slow. So just change it. Yes, ma'am. Sure. Okay, Prapti, congratulations. Thank you, sir. God bless you. Thank you, sir. All the best. Give us a good news very quickly, okay? Yes, sir. And you will visit the academy so that you motivate other candidates. I will, sir. Where is your SSB? 
Uh, so it's after me. I am going for SSC take entry. So, so the dates are not announced yet. Not yet announced. Yes, so sir. where is which? Acha, the place is also not known. No, not known, sir. So okay. After that, you can visit the academy. You will inspire <laughs> other candidates. Is that uh, understood? Sir. Yes, sir. God bless you. All the best. Thank you, sir. Bye.